Um, okay, I think we're going to have to ask for, for directions. Legislative Resource Center. Um, let's see if I can get some directions. Hang on one second. Hi, I'm looking for Alexandria Ocasio Cortez's office. Two two nine. Two two nine. Yep. So you see that exit, the first exit sign right there? Yep, first exit sign. Yep. yep. You can take there's an elevator to the right of that. You take it up to the second floor. Oh, okay. We go up. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much. You're okay. We're going up. We're going back in the elevator. Back in the mega mush elevator. All right. Hang tight, guys. You guys, we have to go up a floor. We're 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 on the basement. We got to go up a floor. Okay. So he said to get in these get in these elevators right so up here. Um, yeah, yeah. Over he's on. Right. Over oh, stairs. We can go up the stairs. All right. And skip skip, skip an elevator. Thanks for joining us. Okay. Sure. Hang tight. Hang tight. Uh, was there stairs? Okay. Hang on. Here we go. Here we go. Let's just hop in. All right, hopping in, hopping in. We're go what level are we at? We're on B, so we're gonna go up one. Yeah. You guys, oh, okay. <laughs> they went the stairs. We all went in the elevator. Okay, so what other questions you guys have for AOC? AOC, I'm looking for AOC questions. Ask her if she will do like Trump and donate 100% of her salary. That's a good one. That's an excellent one. Somebody wants us to ask if she will donate 100% of her salary like President Trump mm. since she's a, um, you know, socialist. 229, friends. I think it's a great question. What a, Trump a socialist. Oh, yeah. not He's a, given 100% of his pay. He actually supports. <laughs> Listen, I mean... Well, well Tiffany, write that down. Mind blowing. Mind blowing. <laughs> hey, so we're on one. We can go see Crenshaw first. Okay, let's go. Alright, let's Crenshaw. go. Let's go. I think he's going to one of the teams. Okay. Okay. Right, we're going to ask you for score. Four. We're a little chaotic, guys. Don't don't judge. Don't judge. Hang on, I gotta get some for my battery. Hold on. Yeah, he's four, he's four thirteen. So we need to go up one more to Ocasio's. Okay. Let's hit the stairs. So we're going to go see Crenshaw because he's so awesome. You got to go up one more. Is she on this one? No, one more floor up. Okay, hang on, everybody. Having to charge my batteries. Yeah. Here we go up. We're going up again. All right. Honestly, we should have hired like a tour guide. This is crazy. We should have hired a tour guide and then we would have figured out where we're going. But we're going back up the stairs. Is that what we're doing? Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, here, guys, so guess what, you guys? The security guy, listen to this, this is awesome. I gotta tell everybody. Okay. So, the security guy said that what we're doing is very rare. That's usually the liberals in here giving our representatives a hard time. So they hate this, they hate it. Yeah, so what we're doing is good. Okay, so that's awesome. So, that means more people Listen, more people need to come and do this. If you come, if you live near DC, come and do this. Walk around. These people work for us. They are our employees. So you, we should be going around all the time and demanding accountability. And that's why they're doing what they're doing because no one demands accountability. And so that's why this is so important. Okay, so we're coming along. Nope. Trying to find. Uh, first, we're going. We're going to. We're going to visit Crenshaw because he's got the eye patch and he's so awesome. Great guy, veteran, served our country. We're going to thank him, and we would love to thank all of our like the Freedom Caucus. I love the Freedom Caucus. I would love to thank all of them for supporting our president and backing the American people. 
They're awesome. And then we're gonna go visit uh, Andrea, Andrea Ocasio-Cortez and tell them what we think. And so I'm just so excited to know that we're doing something that, that needs to be done. This needs to be done. So hang on. Yeah. She might be in the daycare. I just, somebody just mentioned that. She might be in daycare? She might be in daycare. Oh, child, yeah. Child, uh, the child center. Oh, for sure. Right. She is a child. Yeah. yeah. Good one. That's a good one. Um, okay, so we're going to head down here. Somebody, somebody had a great, great point that um, AOC, she might be in daycare because uh, she has a child. Where are we going? Oh, oh, oh we're looking for 229. Wait, this is where. Um, is it 229 or 214? Because 214 is not. Oh my goodness. No, she's 229. 229. I think she's 229. Oh, gave me some, I thought we were going to see Crenshaw. No, we need to go see AOC. Yeah, that's who I want to see. But they said we were going. No. We oh no, we're going to go down here and see. Ben is a. Michelle Waltz. Ben's okay, hang on, hang on. Who's this? That's not. That was okay. No, that wasn't right. Okay, we're almost there. <laughs> Ben's giving us fake, fake, fake names and numbers. Who's this? Colorado. Scott Tipton. All right, where? Who's next? Who's next? Oh, we're almost there. We are almost there. Hmm. Wonder what kind of flag she. Is. Okay, hang tight. Almost there. Okay, who is this one? Two twenty-one. Row Connor. Never heard that one. Two twenty-nine, I think. Greg Pence, Indiana. So you walk down this hallway and each office has a plaque with their name and it has flags outside of their outside of their office. John Ratcliffe. See? And then Ross Spano. They've got their flags. Here's a POW flag. Um, outside of this office. This is David Scott of Georgia. Love my Georgia people. Yep, okay, so we're almost there, almost there. Coming down, let's see, here's another flag, another POW flag. Um, this one is Haley Stevens. Haley Stevens of Michigan. Um, oh, she has a her own security here, probably because they know we're coming. And she has notes, all kinds of notes. Oh, we can leave her a note. This is like so elementary. <laughs> this looks like a progressive feminist, um, maybe Planned Parenthood, okay. or Narrow came and visited AOC right and success. all wrote for notes. No, I'm gonna flip so that's what oh, this looks like to me. Okay. Yeah, that's what this Yeah, 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 of course not. No, no, no. no we're we are peaceful. Here peacefully. We are here peacefully. We love you guys. We love you guys. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your service. Yeah. This is from Black. This is Alexandria Ocasio Cortez. We are at her office. And we are going to be, um, yes, it is daycare. It is daycare. That's what I'm saying. It's elementary. Somebody says it's daycare. Yep, yes, it is. I'm going to show you guys. That's why there's little right notes all over the place because it's like the college sorority where you leave little um, sticky notes. <laughs> sticky notes to, to make it That's why better. she is so, yes. this is like she's straight it's out of high school. college sorority. So we're all Because they didn't have any cubby holes. We're going to leave her notes about, um, oh, we're going to, yes, sign the visitor's book. We're all going to sign the visitor's book. And she's on a post it. We're going to ask her if Common Core math helped get her through college. And Trump. Socialism sucks. No, no, no. Add this to it. Trump, baby. That's good. Trump is your president. I like that. The smiley face. Smile. Trump is your president. You're going to be smiley about it. Yes. Socialism. Socialism sucks. This this feels like she's like her, she's got a little fan club high school high school. Whoopsies, whoopsies, hold on. Oh, well. she's whoopsies. Okay, let's do this one. So we, we added Here. our own message to them right there. A traitor. That's what we well, want to say. The scary thing is people actually believe this nonsense. 
Happy there. Day. We want to have so her have a happy face. Yes. Oh, no, no. We want her to have a happy face. Oh, happy face. Yeah, we want her yes. to have a happy face. So she got Okay. Ready? Yeah, we are. Let's go. Okay, so we're heading in. Stop, we're going to go pay a visit. Oh, absolutely. The law in New York City. Is it locked? They locked the door. Wait, what? Excuse me, I'm an American citizen. I pay taxes. I'd like to speak to they locked the door. speak to someone in Congress. Hello? They hang on, hang on. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hello, Acacia. Uh, staff members for Acacia, we'd like to. Uh, this is, we are your employers. We are here to. Uh, There's lights on in there. Inspect the, the office. Oh, okay. Could we? Could we please come in? I thought, I thought locks were immoral. I, th I, mean, I thought locks were for bigots. Yeah. Wait. And walls were immoral. This is immoral. This is immoral. This is. I'm so offended. Uh, I'm. Hello? I'm offended. I feel like. I so, feel like. Hashtag. Where's AOC? AOC. Yeah, hashtag. Is, they have blocked us out. Everybody trend this. Want, hashtag. Want, where's AOC? We where's want, AOC? We want Ocasio to continue oh, yeah. doing everything that she's doing. Oh my gosh. She's doing an amazing uh, job. Yes. Keep it up. Just keep it up. Yes. Just keep talking. Socialism yes. is amazing. That's right. Killing twenty-five thousand jobs at Amazon was amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh, what a no. wonderful thing you what, did there. Just, just keep up the great work, Ocasio. That's our message oh. to you and to the triggered staff members. Jesus loves you. Stop murdering babies. Yes. God bless America. God Trump, bless America. Trump is your Trump president. Is <laughs> Six more years. Yeah. This is, guys, this is the this way, is, this this is is the way we talk to Ocasio this, right here. This, this, so if you want to talk to crazy... Hey, yeah, you need to get down to her level. You're right. <laughs> if, yes. If you want to talk to crazy Ocasio, you come to this little thing and you open it up and you whisper confession into her. Confession This is confession. <laughs> This is this is Ocasio confession right here. What's Alexandria Ocasio Cortez. I'm an American citizen. I pay your salary through the boss. taxes that you collect from me through the IRS because I'm a tax paying citizen of the United States. I'm a woman, I'm a female business owner, and I'm proud to be an American woman. And I do not support your socialist policies and I do not support your murderous abortion policies. As a mother of three children, I'm appalled at New York's law for abortion, and it needs to end and it needs to stop now. You're bringing God's judgment on our country, and I'm against it, as well as my friends. So you need to stop being a baby and stop locking your door and come out and face the American citizens that you serve. If you want to be a big girl, you need to get rid of your diaper and come out and be able to talk to the American citizens instead of us having to use a flap, a little flap. It's kind of like her. She's kind of Sad. Floppy. She's like, she keeps flapping her gums. This oh, flappy, like flappy. Okay, well, uh, each this, one of this, this, is is this is like child games. This is, this is Confession child session. Anybody home? <laughs> Hello there. Hello. Hashtag, where's AOC? <laughs> I hear you in there. <laughs> this is creepy. It's, it's hide is, and is, seek. This is, this is, huh? Hide and seek. It's hide and seek? Tag, you're it. Guess what? You can't stay in there forever. Can you come out and play? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, so we were, I guess she got the message before we came here. Guys, if you want to come out to yeah. uh, visit the socialist, communist, <laughs> You're, you're a very good artist. I'm, I'm just trying to decorate. You know? This is her book where we sign it. This is her signing book, and I'm just signing it. Yeah. Should we draw a wall? Should we draw a wall? Yeah, Let's yeah. Draw a wall. Where is, it? is there another pen? We really want to draw a wall. So let's draw what a wall looks like, everybody. This is a wall. Yeah. Oh, wow. This is America. This is Mexico. We love our wall. Okay. I see you. I see you. Hello. It's so inspiring. It's like. It's just like, I have no words. I'm so inspired. When you when you were clapping your hands, when you were like, yippee, we lost Amazon. And then you said, you were so happy because you said, we could use that $3 billion for so many other things. 
But you didn't realize that that $3 billion doesn't exist without Amazon? Oh, good. What? Maybe he gets better than we do. Uh-oh. Mail call. Oh. Yeah, they locked you out too, man. Yeah. Shut her fan mail. You got to touch to the confession session. Shut her fan mail? God bless you, brother. Oh, we thought we were going to get We thought we had a in. chance in, but oh, we're locked out. <laughs> but, so when you said, Ocasio, when you said that oh, you're going to use that $3 billion for Amazon, so was the security guard was out here. It just the security so guard, not knowing the security that guard told Perry that, that this never happens. That people like us never come through here and do this. It's always the liberals and the leftists. Yeah. So we need to make this. This needs to happen like every every week. Why? Yeah. Me too. Yep. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. We don't want to be. Violent with anybody, we just want to get them and expose them for the craziness that they're trying to impose on the rest of the American people. Yep. That's what the issue is here. Yeah. That's the issue here. What they're trying to impose on all of us. Yeah. And we let it happen. It's time to stand up. We let it happen. It's time to stand up. It's time to confront them. She walked around, Mitch McConnell and all of them, talking about hashtag where's Mitch, hashtag where's AOC. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, right. if she, she says she's for the American people, if she wants freedom, where is she at? She's not here. Maybe, maybe she's scared of a black man in a mega hat. I think so. She's terrified. I mean, my goodness. She's terrified. What's scarier than that? Oh, you were the scariest. Yeah. Uh, no. Black man in a mega hat. Yep. Ask Jesse Smoke. Yep. Ask, ask Smoke. <laughs> Ask Mo. He's 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 scared a white boy today. Mo scared a white boy today. No, scariest, yeah. You're the scariest thing in all. I'm the scariest thing. Look at me. Look at me. It's terrifying. Right. Young young white guy wouldn't shake his hand. Wouldn't no. He said black lives matter. Black lives matter, right? Right. Black lives shake my hand. Black lives only matter when there's a white person or a cop involved. Other than that, black lives do not matter to them. That's the point. That's the only time it matters. That's right. That's the truth. All right, let's go. Oh, well, bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Ocasio Cortez. Bye-bye, baby. Bye-bye, baby. Bye-bye, little baby girl. Ocasio Cortez, she went and hid. She couldn't take it. So everybody knows that we're in this building. Um, as a matter of fact, they've all been calling security, and security has been at every single office that we've visited. Seriously, every single office that we've visited, they've had security guards because they don't know what to do with American citizens that are actually willing to come here and face them face to face and explain what we're upset about and tell them what they're doing wrong. So I want you to imagine, seriously, I want you to imagine if every single week, every single day, people like us showed up and did this and walked around and said, here's what we're pissed off about. Here's what we demand. I really want you to imagine that. Imagine what could be accomplished. We, we don't have to have this happening to our country. We don't. We can demand that they do things right, that they do their jobs. Because what have we been saying over and over on these videos? They are our employees. They work for us. Every single one of them work for us. It's, it's pathetic. We're, we're done. So we're telling them. We're walking around and telling them. We're spending our time on Friday, and it's, it's, this is a party. This is a festive Friday. This is a festive party Friday, and we're telling them what they need to do. Okay, so where are we going now? Ooh, we're going to go say thank you to Crenshaw. Yeah, let's, let's hope he's there. So you guys know Representative Crenshaw. He has the eye patch. He's a veteran that served our country. So we're going to go thank him and thank him for his service and thank him for what he's doing. So come on. Keep coming. Keep hanging out with us. Oh, that's a mess. Yeah. Hey, look. Tax dollars. Tax dollars at work, everybody. That's... That's, they're pathetic. You know what? I own a construction company. If my construction company looked like that, I, it, I'd be out of business. This is it's just sad. Okay. What, where do we go? One more. One more floor? Okay. All right. We're going up to level four. 413. This is the most fun I've had in a long time. Yeah, absolutely. I, I want to do this like once a month. Yeah. Seriously, everybody, you should hey, be doing this. Kudos to your hubby for putting up with your craziness. Yeah. <laughs>
that guy does not get enough credit. Her husband deserves all the credit in the world because my girlfriend puts up with a lot from me being out here and being away. So our, our, our significant others, thank, thank you, you guys. Yes. Thank you guys. Yeah, but look at us. I mean, come on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're okay, good. that's right. All right, here we go. Back in another hallway. Oh, look at this. Watching us like they never, like we're like we're the circus come to town. We are. <laughs> we're not the circus come to town. We're the American citizens come to town. Seriously, the American citizens have come to town to the swamp to tell them what they need to do. Did you notice one of these? Kendra Horn. Oh. It was covered up with Indians. So they covered up welcome to these Indians. Yeah. What happened? At, at AOC, they covered this sign up Yeah, where it says, welcome, please come in. But we that's what all the sticky notes were. They we should take all up. the sticky notes and move them over to her name. Oh my, <laughs> go back. I know. <laughs> She's not there. Let's go back. I like that. Seriously. Come back. We, we own this building. We're the taxpayers. Okay. We can Ready do whatever go? we want. Oh, we're going to go oh, thank him. Thank him for our service. Uh, this is Dan Crenshaw. Veteran to the United States. We're going to go tell him thank you. For doing an amazing job for being a hero for our country. And we support what he's doing. We support the wall. We support America first. And all of the patriots that sworn an oath and actually uphold that oath. So. Well, thank you so much. We really appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, and we're I, excited. We, we appreciate what Mr. Crenshaw stands for. Yes. Uh, he is a true patriot. Thank you for all he your fought in the Gulf. Guys. You guys behind the I mean, scenes deserve more credit than yep. we all get. Oh, and thank it, you guys. It, it, yeah. Mr. Crenshaw is actually thank reality you. finally in Congress that we need. And we need more Mr. Crenshaws in office. Amen. Well, you. I truly feel like he represents us versus Nancy Pelosi, Maxine Waters, uh, AOC, and Adam Schiff, the people we've been going around and trying to talk to and tell them that we want the wall, we want national security. Um, they don't they don't represent America mm -hmm. and so we've been going around trying to talk to them and they just they don't want to talk to us but we wanted to come by here to a representative that we truly respect and and thank very much and yeah. feel like he represents us. I, I just want to make an observation notice the treatment that we are receiving with this staff here <laughs> oh, yeah. the look at that. That we received yeah. in the other offices God bless you guys, yes. you guys, yes. you guys. Yes. Granted, you guys. granted we love this representative yeah, and we want their we want their representatives <laughs> impeached and put in jail, but yes. we appreciate you guys. But we came in. We've California, been nice. Everyone else has called security on us. Uh, Georgia. Uh, yeah. Ohio. Georgia. Ohio, yeah. Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. There you go. So, uh, we're, we got Virginia. We got a Virginia out there. So we got folks all over. The, we're going to be out tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. at the uh, uh, the house mm -hmm. and supporting the wall, and then we're marching over to the White House at 10 a.m. to uh, support the wall, support President yes. Trump, support all those who actually defend and. Oh, absolutely. Is is he in town? Is is Mr. He's in district right now. Oh, he is. He's oh, he's in Texas. Okay, shoot. I was gonna invite him out to our rally tomorrow, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We didn't expect to find him today, but we wanted to pass the message along. Yeah, they locked the door. She locked herself in. Yeah, there's a daycare. Oh, All right, y'all. Thank, thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Have a great day. Yep, nice to meet you too. All right, we're headed back and, out. And no what, that was fun. Are, are you guys our personal security escorts? Oh, we promise you, we're not here for any. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure people probably don't know what to make of us, but that's why y'all are having to follow us around. But yeah, I, I promise you, we're here peacefully and want no problems whatsoever. So, <laughs> so we, we have our own security that follow us um, to make sure that we're behaving well. 
And I would think it's probably because of that um, petition that we took down to Nancy Pelosi's office, wouldn't you guys think? But these are these are our lovely um, ladies and gentlemen that serve our country and protect us, and we're very thankful for them and grateful for the jobs that they do. And they're following us around in the building and making sure that there's no problems, but we're, we're very grateful, very grateful for their service. Oh, where are we going? Is, is this a surprise? Okay, who are we going to visit? Oh, let's go. Oh, we're going to go move our sticky notes. This is going to be so fun because see this? That's what, that's what they covered up, the welcome, the welcome sign. So we're going to go to Andrea Ocasio, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, AOC. We're going back to her office, and we're going to fix her sticky notes because you know what? They have it wrong. You know, the kids in daycare at AOC's office, they have it wrong. So they put the sticky notes on the welcome sign. So we got to make sure it's right because this is, this is our building. We paid for this building, and we want to make sure that her welcome sign. No, no, we're not going to mess them up. Those are her notes. Those are her feel-good, be special notes. So we're going to make sure that it shows the welcome sign, because everyone's welcome in America. I mean, they support sanctuary policy, so everyone's welcome. And we want to make sure her welcome sign says welcome. So here we go. Back down the, back down the stairs. So much fun. All right, we're heading back down. This is gonna be great. I, we're probably gonna get in trouble for moving her signs. We're correcting it. We're just correcting it. No, we're not destroying anything. We're just gonna move the ones that are covering the welcome. Everyone's welcome. Yeah, it's a good idea. I mean, this is, that's right. This is the right thing to do. She's new, she doesn't know. She's new, poor AOC, she's new. She just doesn't know that her, her sign should say welcome. Here are the people again. They love to watch us walk through. They're like, here come the crazy people. They stand outside their offices and watch us, and then they go back in and call security. <laughs> it's absolutely hysterical. And we're walking through peacefully. We are not here to harm anyone. We are here to, you know. We're here exercising our First Amendment right redressing our grievances with our constituents, with the representatives that are supposed to serve the American people. That's all we're doing. We aren't doing anything scary, anything threatening, but yet we have security following us everywhere we go. Okay, so here's Alexander AOC's office. We gotta fix, hey, maybe she's there. You guys work for um, so Ocasio Cortez? No, no. See the welcome sign. Uh oh. So we need to make sure. It needs to say welcome. Everyone's welcome. Yeah. Uh oh. That was a mistake. Let's fix it. Yep. We gotta fix. Let's let's fix this. Sure. Nope, not destroying them at all. We need to make sure that that uh -oh. everybody Everybody's welcome. Here. We want it to say welcome. Uh oh yeah. These, no, this is a mess. This is, she's she's like a you know she's so she got to learn she got to learn to keep her office clean. You know. That's, they've got it there. That looks a lot better. When you support sanctuary policies, it has to say welcome. Everybody's welcome. Now. Everybody's yeah, welcome in America. Can't have that. No. We still want you to be able to read them, so we're just moving them right over here. We're just moving them. No. We're just relocating them. No. As a mom, as a mom, this is so messy. I just, she's such a child. I feel like she needs to learn to clean up. Babies are murdered in New York. They're not murdered. Oh yeah, you know, you're right. Babies are murdered. Yeah. Unborn babies. Oh, you can see. Illegals all the way up to illegals are welcome. But not babies. And babies are murdered. Um, but here at her office, that was covered up. Okay. Oh, that's, yeah, that looks a lot better. That's much better. No, we don't want her to lose her notes. We don't want her to lose her notes. Yeah, put them back up there. No, nope, they're important for her. But it needs to say, welcome, please come in. 
Because this, we pay for this building. Yeah, yeah, we gotta make sure we. Is that federal? Yeah. I mean, I own my own company. I pay a lot of taxes, and I really want it to look good. There we go. That that's starting to look better. That's for New York. We just did that for you, New York. We just did that for you, New York. So all the all the babies, all the unborn babies in New York, they should be they should be welcome. We see a And I said it's covered up. She's so selfish, and it's all about her that she had. The New York State sign covered, but yes. hers was uncovered. So what's really important here is the state of New York. We fixed it. We fixed it. We fixed it. We fixed it. We fixed Thank it. you, guys. Yes. Thank you. It's, it's perfect. It's beautiful. Thank you. So anyone that's watching this, it says, welcome. Yeah. Please, yeah. Come, yeah. please come in. Yes. Look for the child play place. That is her Child office. play. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then, and then here. Look for the crayons, markers. Mm -hmm. This is what it looks like. This is Alexandria Ocasio. Okay. Okay. Office. So we got to Okay, we gotta get the back. There's what her name is supposed to be. She's got her special special notes from her the other kids at school. And then this is the New York State Welcome sign. And all her stuff. And we weren't welcome here though. We were not welcome. We weren't welcome. Maybe because the sign was covered up. It's locked. It's locked. Oh, we Why? okay. Let me just tell them. We un we uncovered your welcome sign. It's it says everyone's welcome now. So we're here. We just we thought that might have been the problem. Yeah, we fixed yeah. it. Okay, we fixed it. We fixed it. You know. Okay. All right. And, okay. We gotta go. I just I really want her to be a big girl and yeah. take care of things. I really do. I just you know I want her to be a big girl. She's a big girl. She needs to keep, keep yes. things clean and know that people are welcome. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> oh, where are we going now? We're heading over to the, oh. Oh, we gotta go visit Kamala. Kamala. Kamala Harris, we're getting water. I'm desperately thirsty. You can do you go, you go, I'll get my left, you gotta stay hydrated. That's right. It's very important to stay hydrated. I'm gonna snag a cup. Yep. Okay. You guys, hang on. This is this is festive Friday. It's fun Friday, so we're having a good time. Patriot party Friday. Patriot party Friday. I got it. Okay, Cowboys for Trump. Oh. Cowboys for Trump. What? They're being attacked. What? Cowboys for Trump. Cowboys for Trump. All right, hang on. I've already done them all. Hang on. What did you say? Cowboys for Trump? Yeah, they're being attacked. They're being attacked? Oh, we gotta go. We gotta go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going to help Cowboys for Trump. Hang on, guys. Do not stay on here. You're gonna want to see this. Okay, Cowboys for Trump. I don't know, we've got to get out of the building. We were going to go see Kamala, but we heard that Cowboys for Trump are being attacked. Where are they at? The White House? Hang on a second. Oh, I need our security. Our security is still falling. Yeah, we can't spend the money to build the wall. Do you guys see? See, he has to escort us out because they're terrified of us. I'm not kidding you. They are terrified of us. They feel threatened because we go in and we tell them the job that they need to be doing. Now, I love, I support our law enforcement. Oh my gosh. I support, I love them, and, but I, and I'm so thankful for them, but I think it's hysterical that these, these people that work in these offices have called security on us, because we're just telling them about the job they need to do, and it's hilarious. Okay, someone, Barbara said, no. We need to go to Omar's office, too. Omar's office? The, the Muslim, the pro Sharia. Oh my gosh, Ilhan Omar. Yes. Wait, no, let's do that. Uh, somebody's saying, people are saying, people are saying Cowboys for Trump are not being attacked. Oh, okay. Hold on. Hey. Where's, uh, no, no, no. Oh, we need to see Rashida Tlaib. I need to see Rashida Tlaib. I need to see Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib. 
Hey, look, as a woman, I do not want to have to wear a burqa one day. I need to go talk to these women. Yes, Rashida to Tlaib and, and Ohan Omar. All right, where do we find them? This way. Okay, yeah, I need to go talk to them about my rights. Il Ilhan Omar, Ilhan Omar. Hey right, guys, 1517 is Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib, Rashida Tlaib. So we look at this, this big directory here. It's where? Uh, Ilhan Omar, 1517 and Rashida Tlaib, what that's the that? fifth floor, that's here. Yeah? Uh huh. Okay. And Rashida Tlaib. Here she is, 1620. Oh, so they're just on top. Yeah, we got it. Longworth. What? Longworth. Longworth. Yeah. Okay, hold on. 1517. No, I guess it. Oh, they're just looking in the same directory. Okay. Yeah, I, I truly feel like as a woman in America, no, no, I really to need to go talk to, to these ladies. We need to go, yeah. We need to go there. Because they support. You know what? They support Sharia. And these are these are women that really would like to see Sharia in America. And as an American woman, as a business owner, as a mother, I have two daughters. I never want to see Sharia in America. And so I really want to go talk to these ladies and ask them what they are thinking and why they're serving in our American government. They really should go back to the Middle East if they support Sharia. So let's go talk to them. How about I we definitely want to go talk to How them. How about we do the one that committed treason and is trying to come back to America and send them instead? Yeah, the lady Bring them Absolutely. 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 Let's go. 1517. 1517. And that way we got to go through security. We got to go through security again? Oh, no, no. Okay. No, we don't have to. Which is the, oh, you know what? Which is the easiest way? They lead to the same hallway. Okay. Well, can you tell us which way to go? Okay. All right. We'll go. <laughs> Thank you. We we have our we have our escort. Hey Ben, we got our, our own security guard guy. He's telling us which way to go. We go up. Down. Down. Basement. 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 Going back to the basement. Right, okay. Thank you, sir. Well, we can get there just going downstairs. Just one flight. Two. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead. Is it? He said he'd meet us down there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, let's go in here. Okay. So, we are, everyone is so terrified of us that <laughs> we have our own security guy that yes. is following us everywhere we go and um, mm -hmm. that he's having to warn them that we're coming. Yeah. That we're coming over there to talk to them, and we're causing no harm. No. Nope. We're we, just, we, we just love America. We do. Well, we are causing harm because they hate America. Yes. yes. And we love America. Mm -hmm. And they don't want to hear our voice. No. So it's now yeah. are the police officers. He is being great. He is. I, oh, no, I, I God, bless God bless yeah. him. God bless him. He's just doing his job. So, so we're thankful for that. But it's pretty interesting. Okay, this way. This way. Okay. All right. So he's he's giving us our directions. Um, he got on his radio and had to probably tell them, hey, they're coming down there to Ilhan Omar and Rashida Tlaib. Hmm? Okay. So this is so funny. All right. So we're gonna go visit the um, the uh, representatives and see what they think. They signed it, they swore in on the Koran. Oh, we have the Bible. We're gonna talk about swearing in on the, uh, how to swear in on the Bible okay. with okay. them mm -hmm. and let them know what our law says, yes. that you can't swear in on the Koran. So we're gonna, we're gonna explain to that. You know, we're gonna explain about how you can't swear in on the Koran and we're yeah. gonna have the Bible and ask them if they would swear in on the Bible, mm -hmm. that we really need we them. The oath. Yeah, we have the oath, yep. So I think no, that's important. Now they can. Saying, the sad that thing is, now you're, they you're infringing on our religion. Which they you're, should you're, not You're be infringing able to. on our religion. Yes. By saying that we can't swear in on the Quran. But when they swore in, it wasn't a law yet, right? So. At the time yeah, they swore in. I don't know. I think at the time they swore in, that wasn't passed. Yeah. Because it wouldn't have been passed in a 